Frog and Toad by Arnold Lobel. The Story One day in summer, Frog was not feeling well. Toad said, Frog, you are looking quite green. But I always look green, said Frog. I am a frog. Today you look very green, even for a frog, said Toad. Get into my bed and rest. Toad made Frog a cup of hot tea. Frog drank the tea and then he said, tell me a story while I am resting. All right, said Toad. Let me think of a story to tell you. Toad thought and thought, but he could not think of a story to tell Frog. I will go out on the front porch and walk up and down, said Toad. Perhaps that will help me to think of a story. Toad walked up and down on the porch for a long time, but he could not think of a story to tell Frog. Then Toad went into the house and stood on his head. Why are you standing on your head? asked Frog. I hope that if I stand on my head, it will help me to think of a story, said Toad. Toad stood on his head for a long time, but he could not think of a story to tell Frog. Then Toad poured a glass of water over his head. Why are you pouring water over your head? asked Frog. I hope that if I pour water over my head, it will help me to think of a story, said Toad. Toad poured many glasses of water over his head, but he could not think of a story to tell Frog. Then Toad began to bang his head against the wall. Why are you banging your head against the wall? asked Frog. I hope that if I bang my head against the wall hard enough, it will help me to think of a story, said Toad. I am feeling much better now, Toad, said Frog. I do not think I need a story anymore. Then you get out of bed and let me get into it, said Toad, because now I feel terrible, Frog said. Would you like me to tell you a story, Toad? Yes, said Toad, if you know one. Once upon a time, said Frog, there were two good friends, a frog and a toad. The frog was not feeling well. He asked his friend the toad to tell him a story. The toad could not think of a story. He walked up and down on the porch, but he could not think of a story. He stood on his head, but he could not think of a story. He poured water over his head, but he could not think of a story. He banged his head against the wall, but he still could not think of a story. Then the toad did not feel so well, and the frog was feeling better. So the toad went to bed and the frog got up and told him a story. The end. How was that toad? said frog. But toad did not answer. He had fallen asleep. <laughs>